what your Rec Room shirt says about you. The Rec Room Fan. You literally can't get enough of Rec Room. You're so addicted and you spend lots of money on tokens to support Rec Room. Nothing wrong with that. Just use code MAVINVR. The Self Trash Talk Shirt. You have self-deprecating humor. People like being around you because you're willing to make others feel better by putting yourself down. The Actual Artist Shirt. You are the ones most excited about this. It doesn't matter what room you join. If there's a whiteboard, you get excited. The Real Muscles Shirt. Not clickbait. Congrats, your dream of being buff in Rec Room is now possible. Too bad you'll forever skip leg and arm day. The One Upper. This person is the actual artist as well. You could make a nice shirt, but they'll do it better. They're about to take all your tokens once custom shirts become sellable items. The Bodded Shirt. You can't draw. The Chubby Simulator. You spend most of your time in this shirt asking other people how great you look. You probably have some of the derpiest outfits saved as well. The Color Themed Shirt. There's so many more interesting things you could put on a custom shirt, but all you care about is one color. The Doodle. Thank God for mommy's credit card. The Dummy Shirt. Oh wait, wrong picture. The Dummy Shirt. Three words. Dummy Lives Matter. The Logo Shirt. For some reason, you want to make all the logos you can think of into a shirt. From the Squid Games, to Spotify, to the YouTube logo. Who cares if it's a botted shirt? It's just a logo. You'll think of all the logos. The Employee. You love public events. You probably hosted quite a few McDonald's and KFC events too. You find roleplay hilarious in Rec Room. The Meme Shirt. You go around asking people if they're Giga Chads. You have way too many meme custom shirts, but hey, you're extremely cultured. The Doxer. You're asking for a ban. I mean, whose IP even is this? The Picasso. You mainly do abstract custom shirts, and you're a bit of a hippie, don't lie. The IRL shirt. You make shirts you wish you had in real life, and you dream of the battle pass. The Stanky Cheeks. You're so immature. That's a little text over there, I updated the text, and uh, a little bit of cheek action. <laughs> Paintball shirts. You are sweaty in paintball. You search up how to get good in paintball on YouTube at least once, and then some loser named Mavin VR came up. The Star Wars shirt. You have seen all the Star Wars movies, and you cry inside every time someone like me tells you I've never watched a single Star Wars movie ever. The animal shirt. You love animals more than people. You've owned at least one pet, but you want a hundred. You also want Reckham to add pets more than anyone. The Walmart superhero. You aren't the best artist, but you don't care if you look like Nacho Libre and Spider-Man had a defective baby. You're just happy you can be the superhero you've always wanted to be. The Wholesome Shirt. You're super wholesome. You love watching those free hug type videos on YouTube. And if you had a million tokens, you'd make a ask me for whatever item you want from the store shirt. The YouTube Supporter. You love Rectubers. You are the ones wearing their support codes and you tell people you met your favorite Rectuber once. And if you saw them again, your first words would be, do you remember me? Look, I'm sorry, I probably don't, but don't take it personal. It's just, look, okay, you know, uh, all right, end of the video, go.